Granny Needs My Help A Child's Look at Dementia and Alzheimer's by Deborah Mills My name is Zay It rhymes with say And I'm so happy to meet you I want to tell you about me and my granny and a new word I learned. My granny is the best in the world. She's beautiful, kind, and she does fun things. Things like dancing and snapping her fingers, playing jack rocks as she calls it, and making funny faces. We did tons of things together. Granny helped me a lot. She liked to take me by the hand when we crossed the street to make sure I was safe from harm. She held me tight every night and let me know everything was okay. This is the way it was and the way I thought it would always be. My granny helping to care for me. But something changed and things are really different. Instead of granny holding my hand, I hold hers and I help make sure she is all right. Granny needs our help, Zay, mommy explained. There's something going on in Granny's brain. Your brain tells you how to walk and speak. It tells you when to stand or take a seat. Your brain helps you think and remember. Your brain reminds you August comes before September. You mean... Granny may not remember the games we played, the fun we had, the plants we planted, the dances we danced. Mommy said, instead of remembering and telling her what to do, Granny's brain is forgetting. She may forget me and you. She may forget how to make decisions, how to do simple tasks, like take a bath and go to the bathroom. She may get confused, scared, or angry and not know what to do. She may not understand that you are really you. At first, I was a little sad. A little bad, even a little afraid. But most of all, my heart was broken. How can this be? I don't understand. So mommy explained it once again. The doctor says it is a form of dementia. It is called Alzheimer's. It changes the brain and tries to take over like weeds in a garden. I was sad to think of all the things Granny would forget. The weeds were trying to take over, but they hadn't yet. Granny was forgetting, but I needed to remember. Remember the fun we already had and the fun 
we were going to have. I thought of the time Granny and I played in the rain. We were soaking wet from head to toe. It made me laugh and smile to know Granny loves me all the same, whether or not she remembers my name. It's okay to be sad, I told myself, but I can't stay sad. Granny needs my help. With mommy's permission, I'll hold her hand when we go to the park. I'll turn on the lights when it gets dark. I may be small, but there is a lot I can do. My granny needs me and I'll come through. Granny likes to whistle and play with dolls. She colors with crayons too. Sometimes she colors on the table. What can you do? Mommy doesn't get mad. I'm not ashamed when she makes a mess. I just remember she's doing her very best. I'm not afraid anymore. I don't get sad or mad so much. I just want Granny to remember. Zay, my name is Zay. Please remember me. I get angry at dementia and I want to throw it into the sea. Staying mad wouldn't do any good. I just miss all the fun we still have to share. So I choose to be happy even when life isn't fair. She's not like she was because of her brain, yet she's my granny just the same. When I feel happy, sad, or mad, I talk to my mom. She understands dementia far better than me. She got me a journal where my thoughts can be free. I draw pictures, write down special moments, and paste photos of Granny. Dementia is the new word I've learned. It's a disease in the brain. It causes granny to forget. Not many thoughts remain. She needs help all day long. It's how she makes it through. It's not my job, but I like to help and do what I can do. Alzheimer's dementia caused granny to forget, but I remember, and I always will. She is my granny, my granny still. I pray for granny every night, for my family and for a cure. She doesn't remember me or my name, but she's still my granny, just the same. Excellent job, readers. The end. And as always, please remember to subscribe. Thank you.